hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to add the parasol bootstrap header image slider on the master page in PHP I'm using notepad plus plus to write the PHP call notice here I have a header.php footer.php and home.php in home.php I'm including the files header.php and footer.php code is simple HTML bootstrap code I will check the designing part how it looks on the browser on my remote server godaddy let's log into my godaddy account I'm logging to my godaddy account after I log into my godaddy this is my domain great discounts and I'm using file manager to transfer files from PC to the remote server click file manager and this is a web root parent root add file and the files are header.php home.php and footer.php click open and here the files are added let's check the php file on my real domain great discounts.co.in after adding the php files into my remote server Let's check the designing part. Okay, discounts the call that in and home.php. And this is the designing part which contains a header and this is the home page and the bottom is a footer. Now I want to add the image slider here. Let's go to the coding part. Now in the header section, come to the bottom after the menu. After the navigation, here I want to add the image slider. Delete this one. I want to delete the center also. Now, add the div. Add is equals to console class. In order to access any bootstrap classes, you need to add these links which I have showed in my previous videos how to add these links bootstrap minified CSS class and JavaScript class cursor slide data ride is equal to cursor Now create a ordered list class which I want to give the indicators of this cursor. Cursor I find indicators li data target is the ID of the cursor data slide two zero class active close the ally copy this I'm adding three images so the slide data slide one which is the arrow zero one two the first one must be active and remove this class also make sure the first data target data slide to zero the class active after this add do another do for the images class cursor inner div class item and class item after that I'm adding the active class also because here I'm adding the first image the first image the class must be active if you do not add the active 
the images does not display on the browser image source alt image 1 copy this second one third one I'm adding three images and alter the image tags also remove this active only the first image need the active one now I'm adding the images path which I have already stored in my images folder on my remote server the second image and the third image second image the file name is image 2 and the third one is the 3 image 3 now add the href which is a this id cursor do id class now the class left cursor control data slide previous create a span to class now in the span class I am adding the glyph icons so let's go to the getbootstrap.com to copy that class name now in the getbootstrap.com go to the components so in the components you can find the glyph icons now I need the left arrow and here it is for the left arrow I just copied the left one let's flip back to the coding part here in the class I'm pasting that one the class name now close the span now copy this and this is for right arrow or IGHD right so next now in the span glyph icons instead of left I'm adding right now after that we need to add jQuery link here in this one but the final step is need to add the script here script close the script dollar hash this console dot console console and here I'm giving the interval which is a delay thousand color let's save this file we'll check the output on the browser just for the time consuming I have not sure to upload the files on the remote server let's reload this browser and here is the output the image slider is not working properly let's go to the coding part we'll fix it there is nothing wrong in the coding but instead of keeping this script here put here let's save this file let's check the final output on the browser I'm reloading this page so now the final output the images are moving the slideshow is working perfectly that's it if you like this video please leave your valuable comment share this video and please subscribe my channel catch you on my upcoming videos